Hello everyone, this is Andrew from Andrew's Tech Corner and today I'll be showing you six methods on how to fix the Windows Store. Now these fixes resolve many issues with the Windows Store, so whatever your issue is, chances are that it's going to get resolved with the following steps. So let's get on with that, shall we? Now the first method is the easiest one. It's to check the region, regional format and Windows display language. Before we get started, don't forget to like, subscribe and dong that bell icon so you don't miss out on any out of our future videos. So let's get started, shall we? First thing you got to do is press start, type region, enter. Make sure you have the correct region, so country, uh, United States for me, or whatever it is for you. Also, regional format, make sure it's also United States. Then go check your language and make sure it's, well, your country. Press X. Restart and try again. Next method, we can try the WS reset command. Fairly easy. Click on start. Type WS reset, uh, reset, reset, <laughs> uh, and enter. This will take a while, so I'll just fast forward the video. And there you have it. Windows opens automatically. Next method is to reset the Windows Store settings. Press start. Press the settings, go to apps, search for the window store, just type store, click on it, click on advanced options and scroll down and here it is. You can uh, click on the reset and click on the reset again. Okay, looks like it's reset. Restart your computer and try again. Next method is reinstalling Microsoft Store using PowerShell. What you have to do is right click the Start menu and open Windows PowerShell in admin mode. Yes. So now we are in PowerShell. Copy the command from the description below, paste and enter. If you find that you can't paste, you can right click on the uh, header, edit and paste. And that will paste. Let's do it again. See? Next what you have to do is copy this command from the description below, paste it in a notepad. Now that we have run the command, this one that is, we must find the package full name, which is the Windows Store. So what we want to do is right click on the tab of the window, edit and find. Type in Windows Store and click on find. We want to find the package family name. No, package full name. Sorry about that. Here we are. Package full name. We want to then select. Right click. Right click copies the text. But if some for some reason you can't copy. Here we go. Right click on the header. Edit. Copy. Then highlight the package full name and control V replaces the package full name. Then what we want to do, select this command, copy, go back to our PowerShell, right click, paste, or Right click on the header, edit, paste, and enter. 
and it's done. We successfully reinstalled the Windows Store. Restart your computer. And if that doesn't work, go to method number five. Next step is method number five. We will use PowerShell again to reinstall all apps from the Windows Store. This will reset all apps on your Windows Store. So this could be one of your last resorts. What we want to do is to right click on the Windows icon and run PowerShell as admin. Yes. Then in the video description, go copy method number five, which is this command. Copy. Go back to the PowerShell. Right click and enter. If you see errors, don't worry about it. Should be fine. This could take a while. So uh, just grab a coffee. Now when a command runs and finishes, this is what you get as a result. You won't get anything like a confirmation, but you know it's done. Close this window, restart your computer, and try again. Now the last and final step, if you can't get the Windows Store running, is to run the troubleshooter. So what we want to do is press the start button, search for troubleshoot settings, press enter, click on additional troubleshooters, Scroll down and find the Windows Store apps. Click on that, run the troubleshooter. Wait for it to finish. Now, unfortunately, this uh, only works if, you, if you're uh, signed in with the Microsoft account. So uh, if you are, click on next and hopefully it fixes your issue. So boys and girls, this is the end of this video. Hopefully it helped you fix the Microsoft Store. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe and smash that bell button. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.